So here we are in the Spark uh, workshop, starting the assembly of the first prototype of X-Ray. So basically there is a, a long phase of design first. <laughs> Then we do some analysis to get the best ratio in terms of weight and uh, strength. And then basically we do the drawings of uh, each tube. Each tube which are used to produce the car and to, to, to do this chassis are uh, reinforced using uh, niobium. During the process of forming it as a tube, you are adding some niobium material. This makes the metal, the, the, the steel, stronger and then with a heat treatment, it makes the wall stronger. And then you can start to assemble all, all the tubes which has, have been uh, pre-cut. And after that, you weld them in position. And this is how you create the chassis. It's quite an exciting time now for us because uh, we are just received in this workshop the, the wall chassis welded behind me. And, and you can modify the chassis when you start to have the gearbox design and so on. So it's a bit of a, an iterative process where you optimize the design. We start to do the assembly of all bodyworks, reinforcement panel, all the internals, which are also coming every day. And so we need to make sure that everything fits as expected to the car. Some parts, sometimes you can have some a little quality uh, issues, so you need to correct them, eventually correct design itself and, and work out with all the suppliers what is good, what is not good, what you have to modify for the future. Compared to what we are used to do at Spark, which are tiny parts and, and tiny cars uh, with Formula E, this is a different scale. Everything is much bigger and stronger, but it needs to because we will go in a very rough environment. It gives us uh, around three weeks before uh, the official launch of the car in Goodwood. So it's a very tight schedule. The pressure is ramping up slowly, but uh, I think it's going to be an impressive car.